guys, welcome back to Bulbasaur Bros TCG. And today we're going to be playing with Typhlosion. And Typhlosion here has one special attack that we like. It's a uh, massive eruption for one fire energy 80 times. Uh, then you discard five cards and it's 80 times however many of them are fire. And this can hit for big numbers and it's really nice. So Big numbers. And... Um, the line just we play is a, a 4 2 4 line, uh, 4 Cyndaquil, 2 Quilava, 4 Typhlosion. And 3 Rare Candies. Yes, and 3 Rare Candies. Just That's why we're not playing 4 Quilava, because we can candy from the Cyndaquil to the Typhlosion when needed. And the only other Pokemon we run is Tapu Lele GX for that amazing Wonder Tag ability. Let's you go up, grab a supporter whenever you need to. When you, so you can grab like Bridget to bring the, get down the rest of your Cyndaquil or Brock's Grit to bring back energy. Stuff like that really helps. And the draw supporters, too, because we don't run that many draw supporters, as we only see three ends and three Sycamores here. Because you need to fill up this deck with the most important piece, energy. Yeah, which, uh, for fire energy, we're running 27. And that's just so we can hit them when discarding. I mean, you have... A, one and a half chance, about one and a half chance out of 60 cards, but then you deal your prizes, and then you're hitting, on average, like three, two, three, four energies, and that's really nice, and you can hit big numbers with that. And uh, the max damage output is actually 860, because of mass eruption can hit five energies in the discard, hitting for 400. You can add a choice band for 430, and then weakness... Hits for 860. On um, Steel Pokemon and some Grass and some Steel Pokemon. Yeah, so like Metagross, you're hitting 860. And... <laughs> <laughs> when and, that happens. Yeah, and Glissopod, you're hitting 860, which is really nice. And uh, the only other supporter we play is Guzma. Just to, for that gusting ability, it's really nice. And yeah, and again, which you can be grabbed with Lele. Uh, we, won, we run one float. Now, this is could be taken out because everything does have a one retreat cost except for uh, except for Typhlosion or sorry yeah except for Typhlosion because but you want him in the active most of the time and then I'm messing with our Typhlosion count there, it, it, it messed up the account <laughs> and then we also run a three time roll just to get the evolutions and three ultra balls to grab Lele or grab Cyndaquils so, yeah. Let's get battling. You can discard them, Sam. You didn't change anything. Yeah, I know. And, uh, so the ideal start would be the Cyndaquil and then Candy up into Typhlosion, turn two, and then smack for a bunch, but... So we'll do heads. Hey, we won the coin flip. Probably should go first. Yeah, we'll go first. Uh, we're gonna have to take a mold again here. No, we're gonna start from lava. <laughs> Pokemon's broken, it won't let us start from lava. Here we go. And Lele uh, start. Lele start. That's nice. Well, we do run the one float, and it's only a one retreat cost, so it's not that bad. Yeah, but we have nothing in our hand. And we could have Lele for something. We had another basic. Well, we got, got to rely on the top decks. Never mind. Okay, we'll just attach and pass. He attaches nothing next turn. We energy drop for 40 and win. Nope, that's the star you with 60, not the one with 40. Yeah, the one with 40 is free retreat. Yeah, I, yeah. I, I like the free retreat one better, but I mean, I guess in this situation. But he does have Brooklet Hill, so he's going to grab something. You don't know that. Uh, he should grab something. <laughs> Is this Fall Canyon? Uh, no, Greninja Break. Golden yeah. Frogs. Because you play uh, Space Deacon and Starmie and Greninja Break. Yeah. So he's playing the Evolution of Starmie to match it. Ooh, we got Nest Ball. So we are getting hit for weakness, which really sucks. But, I mean, they've got, a, in essence, a Stage 3 that they need to get. But I guess They're they one-shotting us with a... If they get giant water shuriken and weakness, they're one shotting type potions. We can hit the uh, Star You for a knockout. Hey, we can get a Cyndaquil. Yeah, we can grab. I yeah. Let's, let's first let's deck check with Brooklet Hill. 
And yeah, all four cinderquills. Yeah. And all our Teflogens and all our Palavas. That's the first time that's happened. We're um, missing a timer ball. Yeah, there's no, no super bad prizes, though. Oh, we're missing... Yeah. Okay. I can't, yeah. We're um, missing one Guzma. Guzma's in our hand. No, we played two, though. Yeah, one was in the deck, one's oh, in our never hand. Never mind. Uh, probably Ultra Bowl. Fire and Guzma. Yeah, yeah. Then we'll grab the Cyndaquil, so then we can candy into the Typhlosion next turn. We have the fire energy as well. And we'll be taking the knockout with the Lele because three energies in total. Energy drive. Hey, I mean, the early prizes help. Typhlosion isn't necessary in this deck. Just Lele. <laughs> just Lele. Well, has anyone ever tried to make a just Lele deck with like Max Elixirs and stuff? I don't know. That'd be cool though. Well, I mean, it, same premises as Lugia, I guess. Lugia. I remember Lugia back in the day. Back in the day. What's Lugia? Ancient Origins? Yeah, Ancient Origins. Oof, that's old now. And that came out in its own box as well. There's the 40 HP star um, you. I thought that was Primal Flash though. Or Breakpoint. Yeah. Breakpoint, right. And see how many water frogs they have. Those three so, frogadiers. They're all, they're all out now. Okay, there we go. So we've got the candy. We do, we do not get a knockout here with energy drive. We can attach and then we attach. We don't want to have to attack with Typhlosion right now. Um. Oh, attach an energy to Lele. That's yeah, we get yeah, that's what I'm knockout. saying. Just keep going with Lele is what I would do right now. And we have an energy for Typhlosion for next turn. We've already deck checked, so we don't need to Brooklyn Hill. Just energy drive for 80. Woo, Lele. I we got mean, two prizes already, dude. Yeah, true. Another energy. And it is not, Lele is not an easy knockout compared to Typhlosion in this matchup. Yeah, yeah, definitely. But Typhlosion does give up only one prize, as Lele would too. So if Lele is in, uh, in harm's way, we can just retreat into Typhlosion. What did you guys do? Oh, he broke the hill and turned into a Froki. I'm like, where did that Froki come from? It just popped up. We need to get some kind of draw support, though, so we can get down more than one Typhlosion. Because that would help, kind of? Yeah, it would. <laughs> Okay, let's see what they do. We could Shadow Stitch. Stop what? Hmm? If we top deck the Lele or something. Oh, yeah. I don't know what they'd see what they're... His Moonlit Slash does 80. Yeah, two and hitting. He has a Splash Energy on him. But we two hit him also, right? Yeah, 80 and then 80 again. Yeah. So if he goes for a, uh, what's it called, shadow stitching, then uh, we'd get the knockout on his Greninja before we got, before he got the knockout on Lele. So Moonlight Slash for 110, if he discards the energy? Yeah. Oh, or yeah. returns it to his hand? Because it's a splash. Oh, okay, so we're smacking... For 60, or we go with Typhlosion and try to get, because we're going to get ahead if we knock out this Greninja, so I think we should go into Typhlosion. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, just... Because it still keeps two energies on this Lele, because it's only one to retreat. Yep. Alright, Typhlosion. So what do we need to hit? We need to hit two. Two. That's that's not hard. There we go. Hit three. Let's see. I think we also discarded a timer ball with that. We did. Ooh, Brock's Grit. Nice. Hey, that's nice. If I mean, we don't get any draw supporters, we can shuffle all five of those energies back in. Yeah, that'd be really nice. We can keep stacking up this Lele on the bench and keep drawing fire energy. <laughs> yeah, we could. I mean, as a last resort, if... And once this top collision goes down, it's going down this turn, isn't it? Well, it depends yeah, if they get... Yeah, all you have yeah. to do is Moonlight Slash for 80, and it does 160 with weakness. Yeah, that stinks. Well, that's if he has the energy, I guess. Well, he returned it to hand, so... Yep. He has nothing else, though. Yeah, true. Played his hand to nothing. And, but he can one-shot Lele, and we cannot take this knockout here. Yes, yeah, so we really need a <laughs> top deck anything. It draws, and that's going to be game, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is. He, he has the energy in hand. If he, Yeah, that's game. Play it out. Might as well. Rock script, why not? <laughs> Play it out. Here we go. Save all six of those energies. Yeah, I mean, we... He accidentally goes for shadow stitching. <laughs> That'd be nice. Uh, that was... 
if we just had gotten out another Cyndaquil, that that was sad. Okay, Star Wars are only like okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh, space beacon. Oh, he's weak. He would get energy back anyways. That's what space beacons for. Yep. Use the beautiful sun and moon energies. I, I like the sun and moon art better than the any other art really. Well, sun and moon and generations energy art. Th those both look nice. Rift Lele. Yeah. Well. There was the first match. Cyclone and taking lives of Frokies and Frogadiers. <laughs> okay, so we'll be going into round two. It killed our win streak, dude. I had like a three game win streak with Cyclone. Ooh, Psychic Dark. Um, could be Dark Rye with Lele. And it's just a Dark Rye box. So yeah, like, true. Probably is, but sounds you know. like Dark Rye to me. And yeah, we'll go first. We need like a Bridget or something like that. Or three Syndicals in our hand. Yeah. And Lele start. Hey, I mean, at least we have... A Draw Supporter. Yeah, we have a Draw Supporter. That's almost what we're going to have to do like right off the we'll bat. Well, Float Stone, Attach, and... Why would you even attach? I don't know. But I mean... we're going to float it out so we don't even need a Retreat Energy. Ooh, Garboder. You playing Garbotoxin? Uh, that, that shouldn't hurt that much. Float. Should we attach or just end? I don't know. We we're putting energies back in the deck, so we might probably shouldn't attach. Yeah, and we are. If it was sixty, it'd be a different thing, because then they could attach, we'd attach, and then we'd be doing sixty. Ooh, this is even worse. Um, I just say we attach, because. Well, now, yeah. We need to do some kind of damage output. And that's so, what we do. Pass. pass. Uh, yeah, so top deck a Bridget or something, draw support that could get us our Sandicool would be really yeah, nice. Yes, Dark Cry, a Bell Tall, but he's got, like, Garbotoxin out here, too. I'm assuming that's what that is. It could be Trash Lungs, but he's probably going for Garbotoxin. Yeah, I bet. Which hurts if we top deck a Lele. Ooh. Oh, it's Turbo blown. for a reason. We got another float in our hand. Hey, Sycamore, okay, so should we attach up if we attach the energy, we're hitting for 40, we're, that's we're a We're going to discard it anyway, so we're not attacking with Typhlosion this turn. Yeah, so. true, true. Hey, hey Cyndaquil, and we have... Timer Balls, we won't, don't use it till next turn, because we can work any to our Typhlosion if we get it. Mm, should we Ultra Ball for another Cyndaquil? Yeah. Ultra Ball, like, Guzma and Fire Energy? Yeah, I guess. Okay. Then, we, if we hit two timer rolls, then... We'll go for a Typhlosion and Cool Lava, yeah. or maybe two Typhlosions, depending on what we top deck. Yeah, yeah, if we get the second candy or not. Or, like, a draw supporter of some sort to maybe find it. And how'd you drive for 40? What side of the parallel are we on? Oh, four benched Pokemon is what we can... I thought it was three benched. Oh, it is three benched. Yeah. Ooh. So we can't have all our Typhlosions out. And there's Garbo a Garbotoxin. Toxin. We'll see if he gets to float down. Hopefully not, but I mean... Shouldn't hurt too much. Yeah, unless you know, the top deck of Lele, and then no, that would stink, but. Doesn't look like he has the float. See, Elixir. Ooh, he's got hitting for 80 right now. Yeah, 80. Unless, does that. No, that doesn't. Okay. Playing Parallel City instead of Chaos Valley here, which does not boost his damage at all. I'm using an Oblivion Wing to charge up some Pokemon on the bench. And I mean, Smack for 30 isn't that bad, but if that can lower us enough so Darkrai can hit for a little bit more, and that'd be really bad. Goozy. So we'll tie our roll, hopefully. We don't have to pay any retreat then if we Goozma up, and we can take the life of that Darkrai that's fully charged. We'll grab the Typhlosion, Candy and the Typhlosion, we can attach. That's what I would do. I would Guzma up that dark card that already has two energies on it. Okay. And then, so then we don't have to take any energies off our Oh, we wouldn't anyway, because it has three retreat, but I would try to take out the fully charged up dark guy. Okay, so we need to hit three? Yeah. Three is not that hard to hit. And because we have nothing better to do. So like... Yeah, but playing our hand to zero sort of tells our opponent, hey, don't end us. And we hit one. Oh, that sucks. One. 
So they're smacking on a hundred on us. Three, four, eighty. It's twenty plus. Oh yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. He could very well get three energy down this turn. Yeah, he could. Get a one shot. Ooh, no, just going for nothing. it. If we take this thing out, it doesn't look very promising for him. And Ultra Ball. Uh, okay, so we need to hit two. That's yeah, two. It's possible. It, it can happen. There and we go. Is that three? <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's three. It goes so fast. Two prizes though. I mean, if they're trash prizes. And he and hey, yeah, no Cyndaquil. We can Ultra Ball for. The Mm, no, nope. we cannot. Yeah, if we top deck field blower, then no. Do we, we play don't play field blower? field blower here. Yeah, the list is pretty tight because we need all that energy. Actually, we discarded the lele sometime with uh, one of our. Oh, our five floats have died. Yeah, we'll bring up the lele. I mean, if anything, we can retreat back with the float stone. Ooh, timer ball. We can get. Lava out. Yeah, we get two pull lavas if we hit anything. Right. Okay, we'll try it. Hey, double heads. Okay. Oh, no, no pull lavas. We discarded them both. Oh, yeah, we did. Okay. Should have paid attention to that. We only have one rare candy left. So we'll grab one Typhlosion and hope for, hope for a candy. Ooh, that's rough. And I'm going to, uh, ooh, I don't know, should we attach this fire energy onto this Lele? I don't know. Uh, what are you hitting? You're hitting Right 80. now we're hitting 80. That's not enough for a two shot. And yeah. he cannot one shot us. Yeah, I'd say attach it. Okay. See if, what, we can hit off elixirs, but. And we're gonna energy drive here. This is really turning out to be more of a Lele game. Yeah, yeah, true. But I mean, we're two shotting now, so if he doesn't hit for the one hit back, then then we should be good. Hopefully. Well, I mean, we're already diminished resources. Mm hmm. It's not fun. And he's ultra balling for probably maybe another, another dark ride. Dark ride, yes. yeah. And no, it's a Dark Cry GX. Oh, so he plays see. that in is he, standard. I bet he's trying to bring back an, enough energy. He's going to bring back the energy, of course. So he's smacking 100. It doesn't look like he can take the knockout unless he hits. Let's see, we have 140, 100, and he hits an elixir. He needs two elixirs. Or elixir attached if he hasn't attached per turn. Can so. do it? Ooh, N. N. We're fine with an N. Hey, that's nice. N is okay. We should have done that earlier. It would have been nice. <laughs> and I mean, four cards, as long as they're not all energy. <laughs> okay. I mean, what do you expect, but... You gotta float in case... Oh. Might dark find some more energy. Nest ball. We're so far out of it, but he's still only taken one prize. Yeah, he has, true. It's just we have no Cyndaquils. I mean, not, we have Cyndaquils, we have no Typhlosion charged up. Is we, Do we play... Ooh, Brock Skrit. Brock Skrit back in our Quilava. So I'm going to give one energy to the Cyndaquil on the bench here. Yep. Then... Brock Skrit. Back in Typhlosion and Cyndaquils and Quilavas. Let's take a Cyndaquil, a Quilava. Both Quilavas. Typhlosion, and then... Yeah, the rest energy. energies. Yeah, that sounds pretty good. Hey, Brock Skrit, come coming in clutch. You know, the only good thing from Evolutions. Hopefully clutch, anyway. And then Energy Drive, we are taking the knockout. Woo, that's more prizes. We're getting there. <laughs> We're close. Two more prizes. If we can hit Candy... Draw supporter. Ooh, those are our last high floating. If we, if we can hit a Candy, then we can retreat. Oh, uh, if... Mm, it's gonna be tough. If he doesn't have yeah, enough damage, he's not gonna throw up an EX or a GX that he has for us to take out. Well, he's gonna throw up the Yveltal Hall and take the knockout. I don't know. Oh, he's Choice a Choice Band, yep. Oh, no. Uh, so we can bring up Cyndaquil, throw a Float Stone on him. The one with... The one with nothing on him. Okay. Just in case, so. This is gonna be close. We're not gonna have it this time, though, I don't think. We can't have it this turn. 
Um, you can't take out our tentacle though with the, at least not with Yavel Tall. You can't. So, um, do we tackle here? Attack energy and tackle? Uh, we could. I mean, we have the giant hand of energy and nothing to do with it. Yeah, might as well. Might as well. And just hope. I mean, tackle. Hope we get some kind of a sycamore would be nice. I mean, getting rid of the energy is not the best, but the sycamore would be nice. How many drop spores do we even have? Uh, one sycamore and two ends left, and they're not prized. That's not much. Ooh, EXP share. And he plays DCs in the deck, too. He's gonna play DCE and Dark Eye. That's interesting. Ooh, he's gonna take out our other Cyndaquil? Well, it doesn't really matter. We have the He just wanted to get each. his Dark Eye GX in the active, because mm, that's yeah. the thing that can attack. It has, like, Dark Cleave? Yeah, that's what it is. I was gonna say Dark Cleave, or same thing. Well, if we don't top deck a rare candy, then it's over. Clava. Is that gonna do it? No. No, it is not. Like a mini eruption for 60. But that's it. Oh man, that was close. That was close. Two to two prizes. MVP Lele. <laughs> like actually. I don't know. I oh, we got rid of our other type potion. Ah, oh, rip. I, I love the deck. I love the idea. And when it works out, it's great. But it's just pretty inconsistent with playing so much energy and trying to grab the things you need when you need it. It's pretty That's hard. Rough. And we lost a dark ride standard. <laughs> Foreheads flipped. Oh yeah. All right. Yeah. So we'll be going into round three. Hopefully pulling out a win for once. I mean, we've won a few times before with Typhlosion, and like clean sweep wins, but yeah, dude, it was like really good. But... Yeah, <laughs> it's mm. just it's horribly inconsistent, but really fun when it does go through. Ooh, is this Darkrai again? Darkrai, Shaman and Sander, and yeah. Lele. Or Lugia and Sander, too. Oh. <laughs> it's See, perfect, doesn't it? Could be a Drampa Garbodor. Drampa Garbodor Darkrai? I don't know. And another Zorark? One. That's Zorark GX. He has Shining Legend Sleeves. That's Zorark GX. I'm bet. I'm a bet you. Ooh, Zorark Garb. And Lele. Lele start again. The Drampa Zorark with Lele. Ooh, dr yeah. Dr and Lele started every single time. But like, yep, this is Zorark GX. Well, it could be just regular Zorark if they haven't updated their list, but they've got the new sleeves, so. I want to bet you they have a Zorark GX in there. Yeah. I mean, hey, it's a nice card. And thank We're going to have to stick them all this. I'm quitting our two rare candies away. <laughs> Well, if we top deck something, okay, we might not, but like an N. N would be nice. Right about now. Oh, he could N us right now. But he's, he's gonna, gonna grab a digit, it. yeah. Oof, that breakthrough fuller. It's so. It's so nice. Ooh, the. Oh, he's playing Hoopa too. This is the list I was gonna make. I told you that. It's Hoopa Zora TX. Yeah, yeah. Oh, switch. He's gonna put Hoopa in the active. Oh, because we have Lele, so we can't even start doing damage now if we wanted to. Oh, uh, this sucks. Okay. Um. Sycamore! No, let's Goose Mob the Orangaroo install. Right? Okay. I don't know. This, this is desperation right here. Okay, and then attach energy to Lele then. Yeah. Losing two rare candies is hard. Without yeah, I anything really out at don't... all. And all of our Guzmas. Well, because we just played one, discard the other, and there's Ooh, the stand-in. Stand -in, so that doesn't matter that we stalled yep. it Yep. I, I mean, we're going to have to turn. Sycamore. But his mind jack can't, can do 10 to us. So, not a huge threat, but he oh, didn't stand-in. Stand because he doesn't want to take any damage. Do we attach in Sycamore? Ooh. Yeah, because yeah, we can't get Attack Lotion on this turn anyway. That Ooh. sucks. Two candies gone. The candies are gone. Cyndaquil. And okay. Five energy. Uh, oh, let's push the ball away two energy to grab a second Cyndaquil. We don't want to be stuck like we had been before. Check counts real quick. So one Cyndaquil's prize. This is rough. One Lele is still in there. Yeah. Really rough. And then we'll energy drive for 40, I guess. 
not the best, but I mean, we have a cool lava, we have an energy, say we top deck a draw supporter, that'd be really nice. Ooh, red card, giving that's us an extra card. Oh, and different cards, so like, that's the good part. Yeah. Ooh, Cyndaquil Claw, but not bad, not bad. It's got the GX out, too. The Typhlosion is for fire energy in the discard, right? So he can't copy uh, Typhlosion. Right? Yeah, I think it is, yeah. Well, we don't have a Typhlosion out yet. Oh, we're at Candy Typhlosion. We were able to pull that. Why did he red card us and no, end us at the same turn? Uh, 80 times the number of energy cards you've discarded. So, I mean, I doubt that list plays many energies, so you probably don't want to use it, but I mean, you could, you could. Or Flare Destroy 130. This is rough. Got Our two. times. They can hit. It's time. Stand in, here we go. We have a float, we have the candy, we have Typhlosion, we have energy. We've got it pretty good right now. But that's the that's the last candy we're gonna have to be able to rely on because the rest are in the discard. And it's just gonna mind jack for a little bit. So we'll attach. What are we gonna typhlosion this turn? I like oh we yeah. have a close on your hand too, if that's even better. Yep, don't have to discard the energy. And we can sick them all too. I wouldn't do it though if we're gonna have a massive eruption this turn. Don't sick them all on the same turn you massive eruption. Don't do it. It's not a thing you wanna do. Cause then you draw seven energies. 80. Oh, uh, we always hit 80 when we need to get key knockouts. It's like, mmm. Type lotion is frustrating. Okay, so we could mind jack for not enough. Uh, he can't flare destroy us. He could foul play in massive eruption. Yeah, yeah, he could. But I mean, does how many how many energies does that list play? I don't know. It probably would hurt him more than it would help him. You know what happened if you Ace Ooh, Roll Ace is gonna Roll. pick it up and bring in Lele and hit us. What would happen if you uh massive eruption to DCE? Would it count as two or did it count as one? It says. Times the number number of energy, energy cards. It's okay, one cards. one, so that's an energy card. Okay, because then the max damage would be in crazy amounts. Yeah, so just attach to Cyndaquil. Should we Lele for Bridget and get one Cyndaquil out? Oh, uh, it could get Brock's grit. And just play it this turn, just because why not? Yeah. So we have a really good chance because we need to hit three to one shot this Lele. Yeah, yeah, let's do that. Then we can stick more next turn, try to find a can no, can't find a candy, but we can find Kulava and then yeah. One shotting this Lele would be really nice. It would, definitely. I wonder, does he play Zora GX? Cause like I haven't seen it. I would think he would because he has Hoopa. Yeah, yeah. But I mean, who knows? I mean, they're hard to get your hands on. Yeah, they're expensive. That looks like a Three. Enough. Yep. Nice. Well, it stings is two is just ten away. So, ooh, Timer Ball Cyndaquil. That's nice. So we can bench a Cyndaquil. And I saved our other Cyndaquil with the Brock's Grit, so they're all back. Oh, good, good, good. So you mind jack for 90, 100, 100 for the knockout, but then... We can't wear candy. No, we can't wear candy. It's all in the discard, but we can bring up the Lele. Attached to that energy, we're heading for 100, which is exactly enough for a knockout. Yeah, we are, yeah. Unless he decides to attack with something else other than that. But he'd be really far behind if we got that out of there. Mm, yeah, the three prizes. Well, he's taking one, so he'd be two prizes down. But I mean just in the sense of he has nothing else charged up or evolved. Yeah, yeah, at the true. Moment. I mean, he could bring up Scoundrel Ring Hoopa. Uh, not Scoundrel Ring, sorry. Uh, yeah, Scoundrel Guard, okay. Scoundrel Ring was Hoopa EX's ability. Yeah, bringing out the three EXs. I mean, it's, it was a nice card. I wonder... Yeah, well, he's gonna mind Jack. Okay, so we'll just bring up the Lele attached to energy, but he evolved into the break. Oh, so we're not so gonna we're gonna, gonna be, Yeah. And we should've... Uh, oof. Can you one-shot it? 
can with an energy drive. He files by energy drive. Oh, but he doesn't have an energy on him right now. Well, I say we don't attach to Lele this time. We attach to the other Cyndaquil. Yeah, we're doing 80. He can do 80. Well, he's gonna... Mind Jack's gonna kill us anyway. But we're halving... We're doing 80. That's half. We sort of need to hit a Typhlosion soon. Let's time of all. See if we can get some Kualavas out. Okay, that's good. That's okay. Get a Kualava. Yeah. We, and then we'll have Sycamore next turn, I guess. No, let's Sycamore this turn, because... Okay, because we're not going to massive eruption this time. Yeah. We're still going to be low on energy, though, which is... Well, rough. we did Rock Grid a few, so... Four, five, six, seven, five. eight, nine. And then we have two in our hand. That's a, there should be about 15 left in the deck at 17 cards. Unless they're prized. So we have at least a good ten... We should be hitting a ton of energies from here on out. Nice. And we do have the Ultra Ball. Two Ultra Balls, actually, so... Typhlosions are coming. Yeah, we can grab Typhlosion, and uh, another Kulava, but then we're down to zero cards in hand, but I mean, that's okay. Oh, we'll draw and we hey. we'll down to zero cards in there hand. There it is. Zora. Well, hyper, hyper rare. Uh, the, the card is just crazy good, though. We just traded for the first time. I've never seen that. And it's fun. Wait till we get our hands on one of those. Oh, yeah. Dumbbells, too. Ooh. We're getting uh, all the secret rare and full art versions. 250 for. We now need four. Four energy. Four 240 energy. is not enough. Let's. Now we can foul play if he wants to because he has that dark energy on this thing. Yep. I don't. I think it was it might have been a mistake, though, charging up this one that we're going to knock out. I mean, I guess he doesn't know that we're going to knock. No, no, we might not. As long as we grab Typhlosion or. Okay, nope. we have an end, though, so we can end ourselves. We can get our. Four new cards. Hopefully we grab something. Four interviews. <laughs> I mean, probably what's going to happen, but hopefully not. Did the energy drive us? Uh, yeah. We smacked him on three, four, five. Yeah. Bring in Kualava. Or, uh, no, the Lele. Lele has a Yep. Ooh. Okay, so we'll attach to this Cyndaquil. We've got to hit a Typhlosion. Just we have primarily energies left in our deck, though. Half okay, Typhlosion. And an Ultra Ball for a Kalava. So we just need to hit one energy with this Typhlosion, that's it. But then, is it Zoroark coming back and... Zoroark GX can... It does... With, with a Righteous Beating, it'll do one... They'll, they'll have four Pokemon in play once they play something else down. And that does 20 times, that does 80. There's no way they'll have enough. There's, they'll... If there's 120 max, it won't It won't happen. Okay, so let's Ultra Ball these two to grab another Kalava. Okay. Because we don't need any more energies. We, I mean, in case if we get a fourth syndical. Well, how many energies do we have in the deck? Just, just, just check. Ten. Ten, Ten okay. out of our sixteen cards. So we need to hit. We're gonna be hitting so much. Yeah. Which well, we thinks to... that we're gonna be hitting it before he brings in the Zora GX. We're gonna deck ourselves out. Yeah, we might. We might. Well, we'll see though. Oh, there goes. We hit three. Typhlosion. Well, we have one left, right? And there's another energy. Start giving some to Lele, I guess. Yeah, we could give one to Lele. Or we could try to power up a Flare Destroy, but that's too hitting. But it's better than nothing. Yeah, true. So Max Eruption, we need to hit four nothing else. to knock out. And he has to two shot us with Righteous Beating. All right, so we just... he's hitting 120 right now. If we discard four, then... So we top deck... Then we discard four, we're at four cards. Then as long as we take one more knockout, we're good. But if we don't discard four right now, it's going to be game. Right? Because then right. we can't... So We, we don't kill this thing this turn. Or we could try to flare destroy. But we have seven out of these ten cards are energies. So we need to hit four. Yeah. And then maybe we can work something up if we don't hit four, but four is really what we need to get. There's no way we shouldn't hit it, but like, there's a chance we could. There's a chance we wouldn't. And it would suck. But he's hitting 120 because he has six Pokemon in play and it's 20 times. Yeah, and he's already got dumbbells on, so. So, should, yeah, we should just power up the Lele. Yeah, power yeah. up the Lele. Now we have six out of nine. Uh, hit four. Two, four, three. Uh, ten, ten short. Okay, so we can come in with the Lele. We so can't retreat. 
That bow sounds like He's going to take a knockout. We'll come in with the Lele, attach the fire energy from hand, hit the, for the knockout. And only attack with Lele for the rest of the game. But I don't think we can do it for... No. Oh, uh, you just ace a roll. Oh, that's annoying. That's it. We were so close. Uh, Three Typhlosions in the discard, too, so we can't get any more out. He's going to Mind Jack for the knockout. Well, we can't attack with Typhlosion anymore anyway. Yeah. We can Lele for 80, but then... Yeah, we'll Lele for 80, I guess? I mean, this is basically game right here. And then if he even if he breaks evolves, we can we'll hit the knockout. This sucks. It's pretty bad. <laughs> we didn't pull out a single win with Typhlosion. It's such a good deck when it ha in the right circumstances. It's just really bad when it messes up and it messes up a lot. Oof. There's the Zoroark. We tried, guys. Oh, he's gonna he's gonna take an easy knockout on something. I don't even know why it matters anymore. Why he, he could have knocked out Lele and won. Oh, he couldn't have done enough damage with anything. Yeah. He's gonna mine. He's preventing us from doing damage, though. He's gonna yeah. mine Jack for what? Is that enough? Yeah, 70. We're bringing Lele and we take him out of the knockout. I guess that's four little lightning points we get on the ladder instead of three. Okay, attach, so... Just keep attacking energy to Lele. Because we have nothing else to do. Yeah, but then he could... See, 120 is the max he's heading, so... Yeah. We'll see where this goes. Uh, Mind Jack isn't gonna do that much anymore, and he can hit... Right now he's gonna hit 100 with the uh, Zorark GXs, whatever it's called. Yeah, righteous beating. Yeah, oh, there's the Hoopa. Well, he has to do a sit for two turns. Pass. Yeah, draw pass. Unless we retreat into that thing in many eruption for 60, and we get it two turns. Unless we, we discard two energies. But then, back to back to, on back to back turns. But then that's gonna be game because we deck ourselves out. Oh, yeah. Well. Wait, no. We can. Oh, it's not. He's gonna surprise the Sam's over. Oh, yeah. Wasn't even checking that. 1,100 damage belt, and we still didn't win. Oh, uh, the 230 and. We were, no, we hit 240. That oh, dumbbells that was, killed us. That was so close, though. I mean, that was a good play by him, though. Those dumbbells, I mean, they worked out. Well, for this video, that was uh, Bulbasaur Bros TCG. 